In the 7th century Arabian Peninsula, amidst the shifting sands of history, a new faith emerged, one that would forever alter the course of civilization. This is the story of the beginning of Islam, a tale of revelation, resistance, and resilience. Join us as we journey back in time to explore the dawn of a new era in human spirituality. Our story begins in the pre-Islamic Arabian Peninsula, a land of vast deserts, tribal societies, and bustling trade routes. In this diverse and dynamic region, the dominant cultural and religious practices were as varied as the shifting sands themselves. Polytheism, idol worship, and tribal warfare were commonplace, while poetry, trade, and oral traditions flourished. But amidst this cultural tapestry, there were whispers of change, a sense of dissatisfaction with the status quo, and a yearning for something more. It was in this fertile soil that the seeds of Islam would take root and begin to grow. In the year 610 CE, in the city of Mecca, a pivotal moment occurred that would change the course of history forever. It was here, in the solitude of the desert, that a man named Muhammad ibn Abdallah received the first of many revelations from the Divine. According to Islamic tradition, the angel Gabriel appeared to Muhammad, commanding him to recite, to proclaim the message of God to humanity. Over the course of the next 23 years, Muhammad continued to receive divine revelations, which would later be compiled into the Holy Book of Islam, the Quran. As Muhammad began to share his message with the people of Mecca, he faced fierce opposition from the ruling elite and the guardians of the traditional order. The teachings of monotheism, social justice, and compassion challenged the established power structures and threatened the status quo. Despite facing persecution and ostracism, Muhammad's message began to resonate with a growing number of followers who were drawn to the simplicity and purity of his teachings. These early converts, known as the Sahaba or companions, formed the nucleus of the burgeoning Muslim community. In the year 622 CE, faced with increasing hostility and persecution in Mecca, Muhammad and his followers made the momentous decision to leave their homes and embark on a journey to the city of Yathrib, later known as Medina. This event, known as the Hijra or Migration, marked the beginning of the Islamic calendar and symbolized a new chapter in the history of Islam. In Medina, Muhammad found a welcoming community and a fertile ground for the spread of Islam. Over the next decade, the Muslim community grew in strength and numbers as Muhammad continued to receive divine revelations and guide his followers in matters of faith, governance, and morality. In the year 630 CE, after years of exile and struggle, Muhammad and his followers returned triumphant to the city of Mecca. This event, known as the Conquest of Mecca, marked the culmination of Muhammad's mission and the establishment of Islam as a dominant force in the Arabian Peninsula. In the years that followed, Islam continued to spread rapidly throughout the Arabian Peninsula and beyond, transforming the religious, cultural, and political landscape of the region. Muhammad's death in 632 CE marked the end of an era, but his legacy lived on in the hearts and minds of his followers who would carry the message of Islam to the far corners of the earth.
As we reflect on the beginning of Islam, we are reminded of the enduring power of faith, resilience, and conviction. In the face of adversity, Muhammad and his followers remained steadfast in their commitment to their beliefs, laying the foundation for a new civilization and a new era in human history.